Why pay someone else to replace a cabin filter in your vehicle when you could purchase one from filterheads.com and do it yourself? When you purchase a filter from us, you get a superior quality cabin filter that is engineered to fit and function exactly like the original filter. Our instructional video is made to give you the confidence you need to do the job correctly. Put the windshield wipers in the up position. This can be done by turning the ignition to on, setting the wiper speed to slow, and turning the ignition off when the wipers are straight up. Open the hood. Using a Phillips head screwdriver, remove the two push clips from the passenger side cowling. You may use a flat head screwdriver to help remove the base of the clip. Some vehicles have a clip that can be pried up with a flathead screwdriver. Using a flathead screwdriver, remove the retaining clip from the center of the passenger side cowling. Some models have a 9 16th bolt in the center of the cowling. Remove this bolt if it is present. Remove any unsightly debris from the cowling. Pull back the weather stripping until it is clear of the passenger side cowling. This is about halfway. Unclip the washer tube from the cowling and move it to the side. Push up on the cowling to unclip it from the vehicle. You will need to unwedge the rubber guard from the top left corner. If your vehicle came equipped with a filter, remove it. Install your new AQ1001 filter into the housing with the pull tab facing you. The filter has cuts on the side walls to make it easier to install. Return the cowling to its original position. Make sure you push down on the rubber guard to secure it. Reinstall the retainer cap and the 9 16th bolt if your vehicle had one. Reinstall the two push clips by installing the base and then pushing the screw into place. Hook the washer fluid tube back onto the cowling. Secure the weather stripping back onto the cowling. Close the hood. Purchase this filter by clicking here, or subscribe to our channel by clicking here.